April 26, 1986. A quiet night in the Soviet Union. People are sleeping. Lights are off. All is calm. Inside, Reactor 4 of the Chernobyl nuclear plant. A deadly mistake is about to erase an entire town. Engineers begin an experiment. They wanted to improve safety. Instead, they triggered hell. 1.23 a.m. The reactor core overheats. Thousands of fuel rods melt. Pressure builds like a bomb. And then, a violent explosion. The ground shakes. Concrete shatters. The roof flies into the air. What rises next is invisible, yet more deadly than any weapon humanity ever created. Radiation. The sky glows blue. A strange light locals had never seen before. Firefighters arrive. They have no idea what they are walking into. They think it's just a normal fire. They climb the roof. They touch the glowing graphite with their bare hands. Some die within hours. Within 48 hours, birds fall dead from the sky. Trees turn red like blood. The river becomes poison. The Soviet government tries to hide everything. They don't warn anyone. Children play outside. People eat fresh vegetables from their gardens. Parents breathe radioactive air without knowing. It takes Sweden, another country, to detect the radiation and expose the truth. Finally, 350,000 civilians are forced to run from their own homes. A ghost city is created overnight. Today, Chernobyl is silent. Abandoned schools still have notebooks on desks. Toys lie untouched on floors. A Ferris wheel stands in an empty amusement park, never used, waiting for opening day that never came. And even now, 40 years later, the ground is still dangerous. Chernobyl is a warning from the past. One mistake can destroy the future.